Hi, I'm Kevin Windham. I ride the 14, normally Geico factory connection Honda, but have moved over here to factory Honda for the outdoor season. This is my bike here that we will pilot through the national season, and uh, here's my mechanic, Brian Kalma, who will talk a little bit about the uh, ins and outs of this machine, things I like about it, and uh, things that he works on. Uh, right now, we're talking about his handlebar setup. He's a taller guy, so he runs a little bit higher bar mounts and uh, a little further forward than stock position. He runs a wider foot peg also for outdoors. Just a bigger platform for his big feet. <laughs> What's awesome about a good mechanic uh, is that they can actually find this position of this bar every time, week in and week out. When I sit on this bike, it feels exactly like my one at home, right, Brian? That's exactly right. So every week, perfect who, positioning. Who do we get to set up my bars every weekend? <laughs> that would be me. Wow, he's good. Yeah. He is good. This guy is on it. <laughs> uh, we also have a couple different linkage options for uh, suspension, which, you know, Kata prefers different setups for uh, possibly different tracks and different, uh, I don't know, turning applications. Um, some of them sit a little different positioning and help them with cornering. The linkage is crazy for me because I'm actually the only one going with this linkage. That puts all the pressure on me to make that linkage look good. I'm nervous about it. But things went well yesterday when we rode the track, rode the bike. The bike's incredible. We're looking forward to good things. Mostly because of the mechanic, but anyways. <laughs> Uh, also, he runs uh, Dunlop tires. Uh, we have a couple different rear specs that he'll run in the Outdoor Nationals. Probably between uh, two and three different spec rear tires. A uh, couple different fronts. Uh, he runs a little bit lower profile tire for some of the Outdoor Nationals. It helps uh, in the ruts so it doesn't climb out. He also, I would say, likes his suspension a little bit plusher up top to handle the small chop coming in and out of turns. I figured you'd make that a good opportunity to use a use okay. a uh, fat joke because I am one of the heaviest riders on the circuit. But he Norm has been trimming down. He's I have been trimming down. I, I'm currently a ve vegetarian yes. trying to trim down because uh, I was the butt of a lot of jokes and <laughs> got a little bit of a, a complex on that whole deal. So He likes his brakes relatively stiff. Uh, definitely a lot touchier than most riders like them. It helps you know the big guy get stopped for the turns. That's like full movement right there. Can't go in any further than that. Good for stoppies, good for uh, getting in that corner, trying to charge it in as tight as possible, keep the speed up. Corner speed. Um, also, his motor setup for outdoors, uh, he likes a lot. as much power as you can get out of it, helps get off the line, good for the starts, good power coming out of the turns, bottom end for pulling out of the ruts. When you're on a 450, it's important to have enough power to, you know, this is, being strong is not the issue, it's actually making it rideable, and uh, the factory Honda here does a good job at that, both having the power, but then allowing me to deliver it onto the track and uh, move forward. Spend as little time on the clutch as possible and uh, as much time going forward as you can. So uh, it's a good setup. Can't wait to get out and do battle with it Saturday and hopefully we got what it takes to find the podium.